Hey what's going on guys welcome back Samsung has done it now i totally understand that what they did is for the greater good but they have done away with one of my most beloved features of the Galaxy S9 and the Note 9 which is the iris scanner yes it's true you just won't find any iris scanner on the Galaxy S10 Samsung is very invested on the in display fingerprint scanner which by the way is not the optical scanner it's ultrasonic which is much faster and covers much more area than an optical scanner one more thing which compels Samsung to eliminate the iris scanner is that it is a hardware thing, it just needs some space to sit. And since Samsung is going for a full display solution, with the iris scanner being a hardware thing, taking some space is more or less the main issue. If they remove the iris scanner, they got one less hole in the display, which will look better. Talking of holes, there's the camera hole in the display, and the sensors might be present inside the display or could be up top in the tiniest of the bezel present. One of the most important uses of the iris scanner was in the Samsung secure folder. You know, you can have 5 fingerprints in the phone but only one pair of irises. So you can have the fingerprints of your family members present in the phone but for secure folder you can use your own iris so that no one will see what private stuff you got down there. But I think Samsung will figure out something else, maybe like select one fingerprint out of 5 which can open the secure folder. Other than that, yes we will miss the iris scanner but not that much since we have the in-display fingerprint scanner. The iris scanner is not as important as a headphone jack which is available in the Galaxy S10 if you are wondering about that. Samsung just might have to kill the headphone jack someday but that's a discussion for another day. And the Galaxy S10 will look really good with one less hole. This is next level of bezel-less smartphones without making any real compromises. So the iris scanner is one short compromise. Let me know guys. Could you live without the iris scanner or this would be a deciding factor for you to go with some other phone. Which by the way, no other phone has iris scanner. So I don't see any point for skipping the Galaxy S10 just for the iris scanner. Do subscribe for more on the Galaxy S10, hit like as well and I'll see you all guys all tomorrow, peace out.